Okay, this is find two quadratics, one that opens upward and one that opens downward, whose graphs have the given x-intercepts. Let's write this down. I want to do an upward one. So I'm going to write it as f of x. I'm going to say it's plus 1. That means it's a positive. What do we have here? Well, I'm going to write this one down over here. This is going to be x plus 1 half, because that's where the root is. The other root is going to be 2 thirds, so x minus 2 thirds. Right? That is an answer, by the way. I just don't like the way it looks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply. I'm going to multiply it out. See what we get. So f of x equals, well, let's see if you did that. You'd get x squared. Then what do you get? Minus 2 thirds of an x. Oops. Plus 1 half of an x. And then what do you get over there? Well, let's take a look at it. You get minus one third. Now, by the way, I notice a lot of fractions over there. So instead of using one, I'm going to use the number six, because it's going to clear the fraction. Let's put that down instead. F of x is going to be equal to six x squared minus four x plus three x minus two. I'm going to clean it up a little bit. That's six x squared minus x minus 2. There's one answer. Now, by the way, someone says, you know, how you can do the downward one, just take that, right? This is the upward one, and multiply by minus 1. So I'm going to call this 1. I'm going to put the next one down, a downward-facing one. I'll write this over here. Just multiply by minus 1. What do you get? Minus 6x squared plus x plus 2. All right, let's look at the key. And again, there could be a variety of answers for this. I'm thinking that the simplest one is to write the simplest one down. So they wrote one down. It's right over here, the one I just did. And they wrote this one down. Again, you might say it's out of order. It's really not. So it's 2 plus x minus 6x squared, and that's fine. Thank you.